Howdy, 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 my darling Sagittarius. How you doing, honey? My name is Simply Valka, and today we're going to be getting into your April 2022 tarot reading, darling. All right, Saji? So be sure to check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign to get the full spectrum of what's going down in your life in specific. As well, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe if you enjoy. Now, uh, Sagittarius, I do weekly pick a card readings every single Sundays as well, so be sure to check those out. All right, so let's just get down into this, Sagittarius. Let's see what's good, what's popping with you. All right, so we have three rows here, darling. All right, we have the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Earth coming in in regards to opportunities opening up for you. Two of Water, Two of Cups for your social life going on. You're very fabulous for my single Sagittarius or for those that are trying to manifest uh, your soul family, those that, you know, just relationships in general coming into your life. And then you have the Five of Water, the Five of Cups coming into you uh, for things to be looking out for, like a heads up, darling. All right. So I feel like for you guys right now, Sagittarius, things are looking pretty good, darling. Things are looking pretty good. All right things i feel like for you are starting to open up here you know i feel as if for the most part it's like you guys might have had like a tower moment recently sagittarius or just like a lot of disappointments that i see with that five of cups there but just know darling all right as long as you don't get too distracted by that situation of you know the disappointments and what have you there all right uh what's coming towards you once you shift your perspective once you shift gears all right darling things are really opening up for you in every single facet all right the overall energy for this week for you Sagittarius is the strength card coming in here this is the card of shadow work this is the card of lessons here all right so while this is going to be a taxing week Sagittarius it's also going to be a very major week for you as well for not only transitions but also just the sense of like strong healing coming in all right so let's just start expounding on this ace of pentacles in specific all right for your opportunities coming in uh, we have the inflow of abundance a promising business venture as well as important to documents or contracts such a tears all right and so really fabulous in regards to opportunities coming in here all right feels as if you guys are getting to this point Sagittarius where you're making a lot of forward ground in regards to your personal desires your personal objectives whatever that is for you here and be expecting this week all right be expecting this week for some type of I keep on hearing like paperwork also just due to the card itself saying documents and contracts here but um be uh, anticipating Sagittarius that uh, to be receiving some type of news this is a very good week Sagittarius for you guys to be making any type of commitment you have that energy really favoring you right now so we have here the judgment energy coming in here the king of pentacles as well as the ace of swords coming in sagittarius so very much so this is giving me an energy sagittarius where the reason why things are going to start working out in your favor now is because of this judgment energy all right when i see the judgment energy i always associate that as the card of where spirit is actively working uh in your favor to make something happen in the physical realm all right and so be making sure that you're setting your intentions out there to the universe be making sure your spiritual team knows what it is very clearly what it is that you are wanting to manifest out of life all right be sure that you check your mindset darling all right don't be just saying it's just like oh like you know just check your mindset because it's kind of like that cliche be careful what it is that you wish for Sagittarius because king of pentacles ace of swords energy here what's going to be coming in for you guys uh Sagittarius some of you guys are are going to be getting downloads of knowledge downloads of impressions of where you need to be going next you know and so be honoring that be listening to that if you're feeling this desire to um you know putting yourself out on social media starting your own business if you're feeling this desire you're you will no definitely notice this week where You'll just get like these random urges or cravings to do something unexplainably, even going out to different places. I feel like that would be very valuable. Some of you guys will um, end up getting attention from the right people to help you get you through the door is what I hear as well and so yeah be honoring your thoughts at this time and just do it there's going to be a lot of things that you just cannot explain your feelings or reasonings behind it's not you being crazy sagittarius or you just being you know wishful thinking there's a there's a reason behind it there all right some of you guys have this problem sagittarius of doubting what it is that you get and that's not your fault sagittarius you know a lot of it happens a lot of times it happens due to just um relationships that we have in our life that make us feel lesser than or make us feel as if we're crazy 
here all right so be sure to um to not be afraid of getting out of your comfort zone to get to your opportunities because spirit is can only open the doors for you all right spirit can only present the pathways to you but it's up to you to take action in regards to it and you can really trust with that king of pentacles energy that's that nice longevity longevity for you it's going to be really serving uh for your benefit and just um adding some nice stability for you sagittarius all right so now let's get into your social life here sagittarius this is the two of water the two of cups all right this card says a relationship that continues to grow closer forgiveness positive resolution of a conflict all right i get this sense of distance here such a terrorist someone that you might have felt distanced towards or someone that you noticed started to just switch up in their behavior here seems to be a little bit of a progression in this way i also feel for those such a terrorist is again if you have been trying to manifest some type of relationship in your life or if you've been just simply saying such a terrorist being like hey like where can i find my soulmates right where where can i find my twin flame all right you know it's coming darling but you got to be making checking your mindset here all right some of you guys again as i kind of hinted already with that uh first spread sagittarius a lot of you guys might be having this sense of uh not seeing yourself clearly due to past relationships and i see this kind of happening here again uh with just relationships in general i feel as if you'll be surprised by like how impacted you are by like previous traumas sagittarius all right this is definitely giving me a situation of things being wrecked with somebody that you didn't really have and things on the the last time you spoke to them it wasn't on the best of terms all right so this gives me very much so some type of karmic relationship because i see that strength energy encompassing this as well the knight of swords when you think about the knight of swords this is the fastest moving knight but it also relies on their mindset here all right i wouldn't be surprised if um when it came to the situation here it was just like uh, some type of like <sighs> some type of just like in the heat of the moment Sagittarius here or something in that way um let's get one more card here to clarify this yeah seven of cups coming in here Sagittarius so this gives me this sense of where for you guys you guys are going to be uh really making some progression in regards to just some type of relationship that was just previously damaged here i feel i felt it feels as if the main, the main reason why things weren't working out up until this point is because you both had a lot going on in your life all right it was very hard for you guys to both like manage those emotions and just it got to the best of you guys all right it feels as if there's like well-intentioned on both sides but it was just like because things were just like overwhelming for both of you guys in your lives you guys ended up taking it out on one another i feel as if for some of you guys it's like going on a trip is what i feel sagittarius is what's going to make you bring your uh, make you closer to this person here but other than that i just get the sense of like closing off distance and just understanding uh one another a little bit better all right so let's continue on here we have the five of water for things to be looking out for your five of cups this card says things are not just turning out in the way that you'd hope not seeing the positive in a situation sagittarius and crying over spilled milk right and so there's this main emphasis here sagittarius where spirit does not want you to be overtly focused in on the negative because again keep in mind with this energy that we just pulled for you in your uh, uh, opportunities coming in it was really important for your mindset and now with this Sagittarius, I feel like if you get yourself too distracted, Sagittarius, or allow uh, these obstacles to uh, take too much of your energy rather than just seeing the situation for what it is and keeping it moving, um, I feel as if it's going to just bring forth more conflict, all right? Many of you guys, Sagittarius, this is a message for, and obviously, darling, use this with discretion, honey, all right? If someone was abusing you, honey, this is, ain't clearly what isn't for you, okay? But with this Two of Cups here, it's this sense of where the conflict that you've had with people don't internalize it Sagittarius I feel as if your path even if you are putting distance between you yourself and those that you care about but for whatever reason they just are not good for you right now at this current point in time I feel like you guys will come back together at a later point in time once again things settle down and so don't be overly focused or obsessing over what has happened and trying to fix it and then internalizing what you could have done better and what have you all right because spirit really just doesn't want you to get stuck stuck in those emotions there we have the queen of pentacles coming in as well as the tower energy stepping forward yeah because i see for a lot of you sagittarius is you're just taking things too to heart too much here all right some of you guys sagittarius need to be need to hear that you are good people you are a good person there's nothing wrong with you you are beautiful there's nothing that you need to change in yourself all right 
some of you guys Sagittarius just need to remind yourself that sometimes like when it comes to uh, relationships in your life when it comes to opportunities or just your job in general all right you know sometimes bad things happen and it doesn't mean that there's someone at fault for it you know I always say Sagittarius it's like this is not the sims honey you're gonna have some good days you're gonna have some bad days right we can't control everything going on in our lives here all right I really do feel as if at this current point in time, you guys are just going through some growing pains right now. So don't uh, freak out if you're noticing some distance between relationships, uh, distancing between you and other relationships. You guys are definitely going to find your way back to one another, whether this is, I get for many of you guys, it's like you're separating yourself from family or like getting closer to family after the fact here something in that way all right Sagittarius but overall really beautiful energy that I see for y'all at this current point in time just keep your head up all right you guys are dealing with a lot right now I really do sense that Sagittarius so I'm not trying to downplay that whatsoever but to just know that spirit has your back they're actively working in your favor here and so this is kind of a message of just like trusting the process a little bit more Sagittarius all right darling so that was the weekly tarot reading that I have for you honey hopefully you found some tarot cards that did resonate with you in this weekly tarot reading here today Sagittarius remember to check out my pick a card tarot reading that I do every single week as well as check out your uh, sun moon rising and venus sign Sagittarius now also if you want to book a private reading with me I only do my readings through my website simplyvelka.com be sure to follow my social medias tiktok instagram both being simplyvelka same as here and I'll be connecting to you Sagittarius sometime in the near future bye darling